That would be stupid if you did. Hey guys, what's going on? It's Corrupt, and what the first thing you guys probably notice is that this is a live recording. The audio is not live, so I'm actually commenting over this, you know, staring at my computer. Um, but I did the recording live because what I am starting to do now, as I have stopped prestiging, is that I will be planning on, um, I have an app for my phone, I have a droid, and on the Android market there is an app for a random class generator. So essentially what I did was I made a random class, and this is what I got. Except the one problem was, for the Desert Eagle, it gave me a Desert Eagle with extended mags as a choice, and as I'm sure you guys know, the Desert Eagle does not have extended mags. So I just gave it a Kimbo because that's, like, the Deagle's hard enough to eat, is pretty much impossible to use without that. And, uh, yeah, so I got P90 Rapid Fire and C4 Portable Radar. You know, it doesn't give me kill streaks, so for the most part, if it's not a class I'm familiar with, I'll just run UAV Counter UAV. Just because that's, uh, what I'm most familiar with, or that's, like, an easy thing for me. Uh, but yeah, so that's what you guys are going to be seeing here. And what I wanted to talk, and, well, actually, no, so I'm going to be doing this a lot, and I'll always explain, you guys will always know if it's this, because you'll see the live recording, you know, you'll see me hitting the select button throughout the game. You might even be able to hear my teammates talking. I'm not sure if I have my settings set like that, possibly. But anyway, um, if you can, then I feel sorry for you. No, I'm kidding. They're actually all really cool. Um, but yeah, so what I wanted to talk about in this game is uh, not my last video, but the video before that, I talked about death streaks. I talked about how Final Stand is, you know, this bad death streak. And somebody left a comment saying, well, they need the game to be noob friendly. And I understand that. Uh, a big aspect of Call of Duty games is that they need the game to be noob friendly because a lot of their, you know, people that play the game aren't as good, you know? Like I said in one of my videos, the, um, you know, for every time you get a kill, somebody else got a death. So if you're going double positive, that means that the other team has that as many deaths as you have kills. So, you know, they need the game to be somewhat noob friendly. So I thought of another idea. You know, something that will help the people that are doing significantly bad, but if you're not terrible, then it won't really help you. What I was thinking was just one death streak. Not all these other death streaks, juice, revenge, all, all like not all, all these like thousand death streaks. Just one death streak. And it's always active. You can't turn it off. Or maybe like in a private match you could select no death streaks. But what I was thinking was it would turn you into a juggernaut. You know, you get a thousand health. But it would be like a ten death streak. So after ten deaths and you don't even die, you, like, literally, they hit you for 100 points of health, and instantaneous, you just get 1,000 points of health. You get to keep the guns you have, and the perks you have, and everything, but you get 1,000 health. Now, a lot of people would say that's overpowered, but the guy's on a 10 death streak. So, when you think about it, like, a 10 death streak, if he can get 10 deaths consecutively in a row, then he's probably hurting his team quite a lot, and his team probably needs it. So... I think that as much as it would be, yes, overpowered, I think that for what it is, it's not that overpowered. Like, if you look at it in this game, the M60 is a two-bullet kill. Three at long range. And I think one to the head at close range. I know the MK14 is one to the head at close range. But they all have their drawbacks. So this one's drawback would be that it would be a 10 death streak. Or more. You know, maybe more. Maybe like 15 or something. But again, you know, in certain game types, you, like... I, I barely have, I don't even get more than 10 deaths fairly frequently for the game types that I play, because I also like to play extremely offensive, get the game over with nice and quick. But, um, you know, that that's that's part of the game. But I was thinking that that would be a, like a really cool idea. What do you guys think? Uh, do you guys like the idea of that, like one death streak, and make it a really OP death streak, but for a high number of deaths? So those people that are like somewhat bad at the game, but they're not trash and pathetic at the game, will have trouble, but the people that are, like, really bad at the game, really need the help, can get it. You know, I mean, there are some people that just, they're just not good at the game. And that's understandable, you know, for every good person, there's always a bad person and all that, and that's understandable. So for every person that is good, um, you know, or for every person that is, like, really bad, give them some help. I think that that would be a fair idea, or, I mean, it would be very overpowered, but it would make the game a little bit better, it would make the game noob-friendly, and it would make those guys that do go on those really high death streaks not as upset. And also, I think it would be kind of funny if I start spawn trapping somebody and instantly, like, I'm just in a battle of juggernaut against me because we all spawn trap them all onto these death streaks. And, um, I don't know, that's just me. What do you guys think? Um, leave a comment, let me know. Maybe another idea besides, like, a juggernaut, or maybe they die and come back as the juggernaut after the 10 deaths. I don't know, you guys let me know. And peace out, guys.